everyone, my name is Dana Jones and thank you so much for watching Curb Academy. This is the channel where we interview inspirational youth. If you're new to this channel, show us some love by clicking that red button down below and subscribing to our channel. Our next guest is Dana Fiok. This inspirational young woman attends the Immaculate Conception High School. She received 10 ones in 10 subjects for the recent sitting of CXC and placed three times on Jamaica's merit list and twice in the Caribbean. Help me in welcoming Dana Fiok. Thank you so much for joining us today, Dana Fiok. It's indeed a pleasure to have you here oh, on our set. My pleasure. So tell me a little bit about Dana Fiok. Who is she? Wow, well, I'm someone who just loves to have fun. I love to enjoy life and I love to spend time with family and friends. Yeah. What is your main source of inspiration? Because you are an exceptional student oh, who participates you. in so many different activities. So we'd like to know more about that. Mm -hmm. Well, I would say my main source of inspiration is definitely God because He gives me the strength to motivate myself. So I would say God first and then actually myself because I'm really about self-motivation, mm -hmm. pushing myself, giving myself the inspiration to go further and to do more. How did you manage to prepare for 10 C6 subjects in total? <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of work. Mm -hmm. You have That's to be focused and you have to be really disciplined and you have to just know that what you're doing is not the normal workload. So you need to put in extra work mm -hmm. and that means a lot of being hard on yourself sometimes saying, okay, no more Netflix, no yeah. more YouTube. No more phone. Just, yeah, no <laughs> more phone and just focus and get the work done. Definitely. Mm -hmm. And now Cape is mm -hmm. a whole different mm -hmm. story for <laughs> many students because they, it's like they have to have a certain level of adjustment and yeah. they have to do things differently. So how is your sixth form life now? Six form life for me thankfully hasn't been too, too bad. I've kind of adjusted well so far, just gotten used to the heavy workload and I'm just rolling with it right now. <laughs> and you do 5k yeah, subjects, 5K. which is almost impossible. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Very small amount of students actually do 5k, mm -hmm. which is very impressive. So what CAPE subjects do you do specifically? Okay, so I do communication studies, pure mathematics, economics, French and sociology. Mm -hmm. And how are these subjects related to your career path? Well, my career path at the moment is undecided. Mm -hmm. so Which is fine. Yeah. Perfectly fine. So I just did the subjects that I like. I wanted this six form experience to be as good as possible. So I made sure to choose subjects I knew that I would enjoy and I would be happy doing. So talk to us a little bit about your extracurricular activities. So my main extracurricular activities involve music. So I'm currently a grade 8 pianist. Mm -hmm. um, which, which is, is almost impossible <laughs> as well. <laughs> it's possible, it's just a lot of work, a lot of mm -hmm. discipline. And I'm also in the Immaculate Conception High School Symphony Orchestra as a principal percussionist. So I get to play all the cool instruments like the drums, the xylophone. Yeah, I love it a lot. I'm also on our school's Prefect Council Executive Body. So I help plan lots of events that happen at school, do a lot of the inner workings of the school, and then I'm also in United Nations Club mm -hmm. and the Fitness Club. Excellent. What do you do for fun? For fun, I like to read, and I like to spend time with my family and friends. Mm -hmm. I love. Family. Do you have a favorite book? A favorite book? Well, hmm, maybe the Book Thief. The it's book one thief. I read a while back. It's. Set in World War II Germany, I, I think it's a really good okay. read. Yeah. And would you actually want to travel the world? Yes, I love someday? travel, I love culture and mm -hmm. history and mm -hmm. stuff like that, so definitely I would. Mm -hmm. What country specifically would you want to go to? Somewhere in Africa, I think. That's Maybe Ghana, learn about our African heritage, yeah. you know? Yeah. I think I want to go to South Africa. Ooh, yeah. that's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. So what impact would you like to leave on this earth? I just want to make the world a happier place, mm -hmm. a better place for everybody to live in. Just a place everybody can enjoy. Mm -hmm. Indeed, it was a pleasure to have you mm -hmm. on our show, Dana Fiak. I really enjoyed this oh, interview. Oh, thanks Dana, it was and great, it was great. We'll be seeing you on the show again, mm -hmm. soon, quite soon. So thank you once more. Thank you. So this is the end of our video. Thanks again to Dana Fiak.
for joining us. Mm -hmm. Remember to subscribe to Crib Academy. And rem remember also to be exceptional. My name is Dana Thiok and thanks for watching Kari Makad. Make sure to like, share, comment and subscribe for more amazing content. And don't forget to follow at Kari Makad on Instagram. Bye!